One of the interesting things about white historiography, this Eurocentric historiography, it hones in always on the things that separate us. They separate us from ourselves. They separate us from our ancestors, from our history, from our families. We divide, they divide us up into little fragments. And they never tell you about the unities in struggle that took place in history. And so my historiography hones in just on this point. Because the logic of the situation is that if people were oppressed like the Native Americans were and the African ancestors were, obviously they resisted the oppression. And obviously, as intelligent human beings, it occurred to them that by uniting against a common foe, <laughs> they would have greater strength in the struggle.